Hey, uh, YouTube, I'm sitting kind of close to my TV, so you're going to have to never mind this. But uh, anyway, I'm just trying to put up a fix for everybody that's been having the uh, licenses restoring issue on the PS4. Um, I talked to Sony for about a month straight from July 5th when they took my PlayStation. I had a nice customized PlayStation. As you can see, it's black again. Wasting my time, you know, I'm not nothing against Sony, but you know, they they wasted my time You know, what I mean and uh Really like For no reason, but anyway for anybody that's been having this issue Um, I forget the name of the code, but I'm gonna put it in the uh title and in the uh Tags or whatnot. Um This how you gonna fix your issue like it's it's an issue where like basically if anybody's been having an issue where um all right and um basically it's the message where you uh getting the uh you can't restore your licenses and you know like every time you download like me i downloaded back um battlefield not battlefield but call of duty and could not get the dlcs to work like the main game work dlcs didn't work so spend a month with sony no progress at all long story short this is how you're gonna fix your problem if you can't restore your licenses and your DLCs are not working um, what you gotta do first of all the problem is not your PlayStation it's not your network none of that they trying to tell you that none of that is the problem like first of all the problem is your account <laughs> And I don't know what the problem is. Of course, it's still going to take Sony to figure that shit out. But anyway, here's the fix, though. Because this shit plagued me for like a, a friggin' month. But yeah, like I said, it's not it's none of that. So the problem is the account. And, you know, Sony's going to have to figure out what's up with the account. But, you know, this is a fix and it works for the time being. And, it, you know, it doesn't change anything. It doesn't make it anything weird or anything like that. You know, nothing is going to take you out of your way. So what you do here is you're going to have to create a second account here. All right. You got to create a second account. All right. And once you create your account. And you got to go create a whole new, like, PlayStation ID. You know what I mean? So, a whole brand new ID. Like, um, mine both say the same name because I changed the name. But the, I created a whole new account. One is G-Wiz and the other one is Dank and DeLoreans. But, um, create another account. Alright? And when you create that account, because if you notice, and here's the proof right here. Let me show you. All right, you go to settings, and when you go to settings, go to the PSN, you try to restore your licenses, you're going to get this right here, CE33945-4, that's the error you're going to get, that means that it cannot connect to the uh, PlayStation Network basically to restore your licenses, you're going to get that every time. Let's try a couple more times here. Every time, that's what you're going to get. All right. And that's what's causing the DLCs and everything not to work. But the main games are working. And you might get locks and stuff. Because when I download stuff, I get locks on it sometimes. Like even when I downloaded Netflix. But all of that came off. Let me show you why. Because at first, I had, and this is what I tested it on Resogun. Alright, I bought the Resogun download DLC and it wasn't working. So now what you're gonna see here once I go over to the second account. Once you get over here to this second account, alright, you go over here. And you go to the PSN. Restore licenses. Boom. Everything's all good. See? Licenses restored. Reason why is there something wrong with your other account? 
So try that a couple more times just to prove it. Now, like I said, I don't know what it is, and I don't know what's, I don't know what's wrong with the other account. I'm gonna leave that shit up to Sony. They don't pay me, but that's three times. Boom, licenses restored, right? So everything's all good. Now, when you restore your licenses over here, now you notice all the games that are on this side were on my other side. I mean, even the Destiny beta, right? And this is not all the games I got. I just got to down, re-download everything. But the, um, all these games were purchased on on my main account, on the GWiz account. But when you purchase the DLC over here, it also allows you to play the DLC on the other side because I downloaded the DLC for Resogun and um came over here and opened the game cuz I didn't buy Resogun. Resogun is 14.99 and I didn't buy Resogun on this new account. I bought it on the old account like I regularly would, but just continue to buy all your DLC on your second account basically. And um that's all you got to do. Just like um and I'm gonna prove it to you here, single player, boom, see so survival and demolition go to demolition it worked it didn't work on my other account like you know what i'm saying i went to it i bought it and it did not work and i wish i would have recorded it then but i didn't so trust me just download your dlcs on your new account all your main games just continue to buy it or whatever you know what i'm saying like you like you do and when you come home like if, if gamestop give you a receipt and it's got like your dlc codes just come over to your second account and go to the psn store and then put in those codes, you know what I'm saying? And and they're they're gonna unlock it. I'm gonna prove it to you now. I'm gonna go ahead over here to oh hold on. And, and make sure you keep you know all of your um damn hold on I'm fucking up. Make sure you keep all of your uh your accounts logged in. You know what I'm saying? Keep both of your accounts logged in. And like I said, you know, to me this is not, you know, uh a bad fix at all you know what i'm saying it's not really inconvenient or anything to somebody they might kind of find it inconvenient you know what i'm saying not me but anyway as you can see we switched accounts the picture's different you know what i'm saying i actually got friends over here i don't have no friends on my other side but um hit start and why does it say my controller disconnected it's craziness uh yeah but anyway it's saying my controller disconnected don't know why but anyway let me shut this down right quick so i can prove to you ah see that's why because it was started by the other account all right so yeah make sure you close the account i mean close the game down on the other side before you come over here i made that mistake um so yeah, close that that side down, and make sure that you uh, make sure that you um, that that you uh, goddamn do everything exactly like I said, and don't get distracted like I just did. But anyway, uh, here we go. So start this. Boom. See, survival. Oh, okay, message. Uh, boom, demolition is open, both sides. And see, over here, I got ships that I had downloaded. You know what I mean? That's that's more proof that it's a totally different game, totally different saves, you know, totally different information. But you still have the download. You can still play your DLC. You know what I'm saying? Nothing's wrong. Everything's good. So, you know, hopefully this will help people. I know it's going to help a lot of people, man. I've been seeing a lot of people online and Sony refused to do squat about it. So, Sony, get up on your shit, man, because I swear to God, I almost sold this shit.